Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more EU4 as the Holy Holy Roman Emperor. Well, not quite yet, but we are, we're getting there. We're going to be. That is, assuming that everything goes according to plan, which so far it is, we are topped off with all these guys. Um, I think it's worth just sinking the money into making sure we get it. So mines, I think we've already influenced with. We didn't gift him. We don't have any money, but we have lots of money coming in. 18 ducats? There's no way. Is that real? Goodness gracious. That's with all our forts on? No, just a couple of them. Right, because of um, devastation. So we're going to slowly but surely work our way back up. Um, I think we can uh, just turn that on to no edict. This one is defensiveness, and we can turn that one off as well as that one. So I'm, I'm upset about the last episode where we where we lost that. Um, I'm curious if we could get... I'm curious if we would be able to get our... Um, <clears throat> another war with France. Let's see here. Austria would not join. It's because of favors. Castile would be favors and debt. So how many favors do you owe me? Very close. Two years and two years. So January of 30 and January of 30. So even after we get it though, Castile's not gonna join. So I'm going to need to um, think of something to do in the meantime. We need to find a way to expand and I suppose it, this would be a good call. Um, hmm. Because we can't really just directly attack Genoa. Wait, oh, we totally could. Oh, we totally could. What's our force limit? 845. So we could totally build up to that. So we lost all of our cannons against the French, I remember. So let's spend a couple of months building up to force limit. Or at least, not force limit, but getting some men in the field. Um. Okay. I mean, I can't really defend him, honestly. What is this one? I usually just go with the burgers one. Uh, let's make sure we are, they're good. We are. And uh, <clears throat> let's actually take, take that click. Uh, right, then. So you guys can get a gift, I believe. I'll send that, that's fine. Just want to make sure that we are as close to getting this as we possibly can. So we've influenced them, we have not gifted them, but we're already at maxed out opinion, so I'm just gonna keep it at that. Um, I suppose our golden era is over, which is, you know, sad times, but that's okay. Um, I'd really rather not lose the Diplo, but I also don't want to lose the Stab, but I suppose... That's okay. Clerical dominance. Goody. Missionary strength, tolerance of true faith, papal influence, stab cost. Wish I would have got that like a minute ago. I think I'd rather just take the prestige for the morale. Um, let's get you guys over there. Get another cannon in the army there. A couple more can- um, our Regular dudes, and I think we need to get up to four artillery, or camp cavalry, I should say. Um, level two trade guy, that would be nice, but I think we need to keep our diplo guy for now, but we'll, we'll take him. Uh, yeah. We'll take him, just in case we're able to get him later on. Um, and we will build up to this force limit here. Do we have a claim on him? I guess I should have looked. We do. We have a claim on these two provinces. Um, I don't think we'll have the navy to compete. So these guys are hunting pirates. So as soon as I pull these guys back, we're going to get raided. I guarantee it. But I'm going to need them all. <clears throat> yep, 
Yep, they rated, they rated it literally this like two months later. So Naples is still just like disgustingly devastated. Um, we'll take Godfrey Stichtenstein. Uh, Mantua. So it's basically Mantua, Pope Man, and Savoy. I might be able to vassalize Savoy and reconquest. Think that sounds like a good plan. Um, could I attack him directly? No, I think I'd rather take this land. It's better for trade. I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to take Genoa, but we can do our best. Um, I also need to just make sure that what I'm doing is not um, going to be causing too much aggressive expansion. So let's go for that. So everybody honored. Let's see if we can get a quick stack wipe here. It is mountain, so I do need to be careful, but I think, yep. That's fine. Um, so Pope Man's just gonna be down here sieging all this down. So I will actually switch that edict back on. And he's sitting at, yeah, he's never gonna get it. Um, and let's just siege this Cuneo down. Let us also, no, I didn't mean to do that. I guess I, I can do this. This is fine. Um, let's also build a spy network here and then build a spy network on Pope Man. And I think we can send a gift to you. So we'll do that. 10. I guess I don't need to. I'm already maxed out on opinion. So. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. So this province got devastation. I'm going to have to take a fort or else I'm never going to get it any uh, improved at all. One more for 25% fort defense, which is nice. Dude, they're just raiding all my coasts. There's literally nothing I can do. What is our... Yeah, like, it's too close to let my guys run free, naval-wise. Just get those guys over there with a uh, general. So we won the siege of Cuneo. Let's get over here on Genoa. So probably what's going to happen is I'm going to have to peace out Mantua and Pope Man, and then I will peace out um, Savoy and vassalize him as well as maybe take these two provinces. Is what I'm hoping for, but we'll see. <clears throat> we'll see what happens. Not Lucka. Not my good vassal. He's a good boy, I swear. Oh, he didn't get stack wipe. Oh, wait. He, yeah, he didn't get stack wipe. Very nice. Cool. So let's get you guys over here. I actually forgot that Lucka was my vassal. And he's still at negative 57. Still at negative 57. Dude, look at that. That's why defensiveness is, uh... This is why defensiveness is, is so strong. But I also feel like he's just having a lot of really bad luck, but... I am, uh, totally fine with that. <laughs> Decline of the nobility. So we have two loans for 360. I didn't even realize that was a thing. Alright, um... So we're winning that, and I think I will just let it ride out. So we lost three, and they lost a lot more than that, so... I will take that, we gained some prestige. Very nice. So that actually just gave us superiority. They do have two heavies in there somewhere. You know it's not screwing around. Pope Man is, you know, sitting here for a year. Let's 
civil war in Lithuania? Oh, what in the world? What in the world? Oh, I didn't even realize this. Hey, jerk. <laughs> I totally didn't even realize I was getting sieged down by Pomerania. Poland? Come on now, he's sieging down my capital. My prosperity, though. You son of a gun. Hmm. Yeah, I totally didn't even realize that that was a thing. I mean, realistically, what I should be doing is breaking this siege off to go fight him, but... Eh. I'll always take a free stab. Do I make them mad for a couple months? I think it's always worth it for the clicks. Um, just wait till the end of the month here to get those texts. There we go. So we won Mantua. Hopefully we don't lose our capital. We did not. Let's get you guys over there. So we might actually be able to just do this piece right now. Um, Savoy will be our vassal. <clears throat> so they actually will accept that soon. He's going to win Naples, probably. So let's see if blockading Roma will, uh, very close, actually. We lost the Siege of Naples. Did we lose our capital? We did not. Very good. Well, we can save that. He doesn't even have a leader there, so... That's, uh... It's all fine and dandy. Get off my lawn! You jerk! Hmm... I guess I can come down here and defend this land as well. Probably should, right? Hopefully they don't win that. They did not. Very good. Probably a stack wipe for me. No stack wipe, but... Alright. So I think I have to peace out these guys. Take a little bit of prestige for it. Sounds good. Let's get you guys over here. Let's see if we can save Lucka. Or lost our Admiral, which is no fun. Can we get one from the burgers? No, we cannot. <clears throat> it's never ideal spending the diplo when you have a diplo idea, but uh I think I'm willing to make the take the uh take the hit there. Hopefully he doesn't reinforce. Uh, I mean This is definitely a good battle for us. Um so let's just get down to Roma. And we can just drop a couple of guys off on the way. Siege down some of this stuff. As soon as we actually sit on Rome, we should be fine. Pope man would actually peace out for war reps. Ideally, I would take trade from him, but I think war reps is sufficient if it gets me out of the war. And that allows me to uh, do this piece right here. Very good. And we will just immediately improve, increase that, as well as that. Cool. And as far as this goes, we lost Cologne. Hmm. We are pretty close to our Diplo rep. So I think I really need to focus that. We are losing points because of that. Right, we also picked up another vassal here um <clears throat> let's improve with you and i think i can't really annex him because that would hurt my uh 
Yeah, that would hurt me. So. Hmm. <laughs> I'm not sure. <clears throat> Thinking for now. I need to get him back to voting for me. Because, like, if the Emperor dies right now, I don't win. So they're my ally, but they will not vote for me. I have royal ties with them, so... Cologne, why will you not vote for me, you jerk? Doesn't trust mean something? Maybe it's my, uh, legitimacy? Okay. I gotta really keep an eye on that. That could go bad for me at any given time. I also have 20 with him, so I should just get a claim on that and call it a day. <clears throat> Let's, uh... So we are okay. Man, it is so close. It's honestly way too close for me, but I'll take it. Just hope for the best, I suppose. I would like to uh, not be experiencing all this war exhaustion. That would be nice as well. Oh, right. The overextension is hurting my diplo rep, isn't it? Yes, it is. So as soon as we finish that, that'll be good. As well as we getting this um, diplomatic rep relations. So that'll be coming here in a couple of years. We're just going to keep reinforcing it. I feel like that's not a good call. Let's get you guys over there. What's the chance we win Pope Man? Decent, actually. It's not bad at all. Um, the fact that we're at war with Poland is just like no fun at all. So actually I'm fabricating on Pope Man. That's kind of not what I want. <clears throat> I want him to like me so I can maximize my stuff so I can get Papal Controller. Because I think you get... Extra diplomat, advisor cost is good, AE impact is huge, tech cost is nice. It's honestly just a, a nice little thing to have. Let's get you guys switched out there. Save a little bit of manpower if we can. Yeah, this is no good. I did not realize that Poland was going to be in there. I should have been a little quicker to look, but... You live and you learn, I suppose. So, we are still good. Are you maxed out? No, let's improve... Let's top off relations with a couple of these guys. Um... <clears throat> Trier... Laid a claim to the Palatinate, huh? Do I care about inflation a whole lot? We're losing it right now. <clears throat> hmm. I wonder if that hurts his relations. <clears throat> so I have an alliance with him, actually. That hurts his relations with him a lot. But he's only one away from voting for me. We'll see. Uh, let's get you guys over here and see if we can do a little something sneaky sneaky. Might be able to encourage a white piece if we can, um... Let's actually make sure we improve with you as well. <clears throat> Have a sip of my tea here. Ah, very good. Try to get that throat cleared out, you know? I would really prefer it if you didn't sneak onto my lands, my friend. <clears throat> he doesn't have any reason to be over here, so he's definitely just trying to be sneaky. I'm taking lots of attrition over here. Yeah. 
There you go. Very good. Alright, so let's get you guys up over here and then up over here. Ideally, I'm not fighting rebels for no reason. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Yeah, you know it's me when I got the throat clearing going on. Alright, so let's see here. What in the world? Yeah, I would really rather you didn't attack me in the woods. Thank you, sir. Send a couple men over there. Nope, that is not what I did. There you go. And they're immediately going right back. Alright, let me out. Whatever. Hopefully that doesn't revoke my guarantee or anything with him. I'm just so done with that one. Let's uh, get you guys down here. No, quit walking through my lands, please. I do not want to get on Black Flag. Uh, we will rival France for sure. That's an easy one. It sucks how many Diplo points we're losing from these relationships. Honestly, I need to just break this. Oh. I'm trading basically... A bunch of stab, or a bunch of admin for that, but... I don't know. I think I hold off on it. England, huh? So sick of getting pulled into wars that I'm just getting my teeth kicked in. And anyways, I would love more than anything to be able to finally get some prosperity again. Those provinces were just like ravaged for so long. There was nothing I could do about it. So I can reconquest this. I could even call in some people. Montferrat, go call in him, and he would just call in Switzerland. So I got actually reconquest from Switzerland as well. That's actually perfect. Um, mine seems like a good ally for this one. All right, let's get you guys joined up over here. They are not getting siege down, so we can do that. Am I not at war with Milan? I am not. Wait, I won that siege that fast? Sheesh. Now well, let's get up here. Mines isn't even helping me, so that's fine. That's it, that's it. The electors have elected John III of Jerusalem. We are now the Holy Roman Emperor. <laughs> All right, I like it. That's a good place. That's a good place to end it for sure. Check that out. King of Jerusalem, or the Duke of... Yeah, I am the king. Because I'm technically not a member. But I could add all this. Hmm. Interesting. I suppose right now I could move my capital in, right? Just can't do it while I'm at war. Interesting. Well, let's finish up this war real quick. Episode is definitely going to be over here soon. Just one out of this war. So, these are the two going to him. Just need to siege down his capital for sure. Yeah, and I'd rather just loot a couple of ticks. <coughs> Excuse me. So Pomerania basically full annex Saxony. I uh goodness gracious. 
Yeah, that's a thick looking Pomerania up there, but I wonder what kind of aggressive expansion he just took on. Hardly. Just the just enough. Well, Mines is getting siege down. Hopefully he doesn't siege his capital. That way I don't he doesn't break 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 alliances with me. Um come on now. Win the siege. Oh. Booey. See, look at this. Yeah, I'll keep influencing the electors. Definitely should. So he's gonna win that and he's gonna Oh, he didn't win it. Yes, 15 to seat. Man, this is bogus. And I just broke the siege there. Did I have a wall breach? I might have. Manpower modifier, discipline. I'll go with discipline. I'm all about the discipline. Okay, so he didn't break alliances or anything, so that's nice. What in the world? How do we not have enough men to siege that down? All oh, right, that was mines' his army on there. Cool. Well, let's just see here. Honestly, we just need to take this cap, this fort right here, and we can peace out instantly. Oh, just win the freaking siege, man! Win the siege! Win the siege! Win the siege! Win the siege! Oh my goodness gracious! RNG is fun. EU4 is fun. Watching RNG. Hey, are you guys having fun yet? I know I am. I'm just having so much fun. <laughs> Let's see if we can sit on this fort for a little bit longer and have a little more fun, right? Ay ay ay. Okay, about damn time. So, does he did he have any of this before? I could, let's see what it would cost to actually give it to him so I could link up those lands. I could do that. Let's do that actually. Wait one more monthly tick and switch that over. That. I mean, I'd really rather you didn't do that, man. Random rebels attacking my men, soaking up my manpower. All right, so let's do that and then take one ducat from you. Very good. Oh, right, it's not actually connected, but that's fine. Um, oh, I'm gonna regret bringing them over here. All right, sorry if you guys can hear my dog, by the way. My wife is uh, antagonizing him. So, okay, cool. That's a good place to end it. Hope you guys are enjoying the series. If you are, please show your support and leave a like. If you're excited to finally be the Holy Roman Emperor, please show your support and leave a like. Look at that, that's cool. Um, if you guys want to see some more of this, you can subscribe, and if you want to check out the Discord or the Patreon to support the channel, the links for those are in the description down below. And with all that being said, this is Chewy Shoot, and I'll catch you guys later. I'd like to give a big special shout out to Classified for Life, Lemongrass Bob, Miner Joe, and TM Raw for their awesome support on Patreon. You guys are awesome. If you guys want to see some more of this series, it's going to be linked there in the top right corner. And below that will be another one that I think you guys might want to check out. If you haven't already, click the little subscribe button in the middle of the video. And that's all I got. Catch you guys later.